Hello, we're going to talk about how to access Google Meet as a student um, or parent if you've uh, been invited to a Google Meet, perhaps with a teacher or anything like that. So we're going to look at it from the student side of it. Uh, students can enter Google Meets a variety of ways. Uh, one of the ways is your teacher may set up or embed a Google Meet as part of their Google Classroom. So if you log in to your Google Classroom page and you see all of the classes that you're a student of, you would go in and you would see the meeting link and your Google meeting link would be right up in the header of your Google Classroom. And that Google Meet link would be specific just to that class. So if I had a social studies class, science class, different meet for different class. That's one way that your teacher could set up a Google Meet. Another way that you could set up a Google Meet, and we'll talk about this as well as, um, so if we wanted to do this one, I'd just click on it, would go ahead and join the Google Meet, would start the meeting and get going with everything. Another way that you could set up or join a Google Meet would be your teacher has invited you. And so I'm going to go to another account here to show you what that would look like. And I'm going to go to and look at my calendar. And so your student would have a calendar or parent. And so if you got invited, um, your, if, you're, if you have a Gmail account, this is all looking at Gmail, your student, maybe they have a set meeting time with their teacher or anything like that. So they have a Google Calendar, which is also a great spot to look at all of their assignments or things that are coming up. And so one of the things that you've got on here is for today's calendar, you could set up a training, I set up a training meeting you can click on that meeting and it has all of the meeting details that I created and I can join with Google Meet. So I'm gonna go ahead and join this one with Google Meet. When it gets set up, it'll turn your camera on by default. It'll join the meeting. Um, by default, you're muted for the meeting. Um, so you can turn the microphone on by clicking on the red button. It turns green. Uh, you can turn the camera on by clicking the red button. When you're ready to end the meeting, you would simply hit to leave the call. And so that would give you the ability to leave the call. You can also turn off the speaker, which would be hearing the audio coming in from the others. Um, so if you wanted to turn off your computer speaker, then there would be no audio coming through here. So this would be um, how you could join a Google Meet you, through the calendar. Um, the last way that you could join a Google Meet, again, you're logged in to your Google account or a student is logged into their Google account and you can find the Meet icon through your Google App Launcher. And through the Meet icon, if I go to that, it will have my Meets that are scheduled for the day or the time that are going on. So uh, in my other account, I'd set up a training meeting. So it's the exact same thing. So I could go through and join the meet the exact same way. So those are the three ways that you can join a Google Meet or have your student join a Google Meet to participate in uh, virtual learnings with their teachers.